Hello guys, uh, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm just going to do a, a video on the Ale Strike MG Remastered. I actually have the first version of the um, Ale Strike and I'll show you a comparison later on for you guys who may be more familiar with this kit versus the older kit. Um, again, I got this kit uh, fully built from uh, another uh, builder. Um, and interestingly, this particular kit um, came with a came attached with a special backpack. If you can see, it's actually this guy over here. I'll just make a turn here, and you can actually see it's actually like a, a special spacecraft. To be honest, I have not managed to find out um, which uh, where it came from. Is it a P Bandai or from another particular guy? But if you look. It's quite quite nice. I'll show you later on when I pick. I can pick it out um, as opposed to the normal backpack of the Ale Strike. Uh, this one is actually quite unique in the sense that um, it is actually a uh, spacecraft, right? But all in all, this this particular Ale Strike is a must get for you uh, seat fans for sure. Um, it comes with um, the the base, right? The, the launch base, yeah. Um, and you can actually stand here. But we'll have some pictures later on to show you it uh, standing on the the launch hanger. So just uh, if I remove this and I'll show you um, how it looks like. So, as you know, with a lot of these um, kits, it has an attachment at the back. And okay, sorry, I've uh, just uh, switched back the backpacks to the back to the original um, Hill Strike backpack. Okay, and just give you a, a spin. I'm not sure why. For me, I'm not able to lift this wing up and give it an angle. I'm not sure what I've done wrong. If anybody knows, you can maybe tell us. Tell me. I've looked at my old pack and um, I still can't figure out why I, I'm not getting it um, correct. So this can actually come down a little bit and, and you can angle it um, to give it more uh, a, a, a more aggressive look. And you can see I've actually att attached this little, I don't know, I call it a tail um, to the guy as well. The original backpack is also pretty nice. You know, look at all the thrusters and all that. Um, it's a very nice, uh, nifty design too. Okay, so I've removed the backpack I showed you just now, and uh, here is it, so that you can actually have a look at it up close. Uh, what backpack? How it looks like. So this is how it looks like. This is the the aircraft. Quite nice. Yeah. And like I said, it has this attachment that can go in into a couple of the different uh, mobile suits. Okay, if anybody knows which uh, what backpack it is, uh, if you can like kindly leave it on a comment, that'd be much appreciated. I'm yet to find out which um, backpack this is. Okay, so here is a side by side comparison between the remaster, uh, which is on the basically on on your right. This is the remastered um, Ale Strike, and this is the first version or maybe 1.0 uh, of the Ale Strike. Okay, you can see there is actually quite a vast difference uh, when it comes to the details. Okay, anywhere from the the torso, the chest area, even the the head is very different. You can see much more details here. Um, the even the front uh, areas here all have very much difference and you can see the leg and all that also has a lot more um, details and, and lines in there uh, also all the way down to the foot as well okay um, obviously if you want to get and you want to get this this one obviously is I think out of print already you won't be able to find any more in the market I believe this one is very popular um, obviously this one will be a better choice versus this but this is kind of like a classic model as well now, um, um, 
but shade wipe obviously is the same because it's the same mobile suit anyway right so let me turn this around and show you the thrusters at the side from the side so you can see very much um, different as well when it comes to the details size wise this is what i mean by the wing right i can actually angle it upwards but for this one i really tried i'm not sure why um, i could not uh, get it up or uh, at an angle right moving on to the design of the backpack at the back you can see again a lot much more details on the remastered version um, versus the version 1.1 this one has like a, a, the longer fin at the bottom for the thrusters but this one is uh, kind of like opposite way but more or less quite equal when it comes to the distance as well yeah um, ba the base wise um, that you actually get mm, I would say it's, it's actually more or less identical because again that's that's not the major thing but the mobile, mobile suit itself obviously has a uh, I would say when you put them side by side, a huge comparison. So I got this guy first, also uh, fully assembled from another builder, then got this guy. Okay, um, yeah. Uh, so now I thought I would show you another of the guy that I have, a, a very classic or old masterpiece. This is actually, it's not, it's got actually a no grade, it's a 160, right? 160 Strike Freedom. I don't think it's even a, uh, it's not an L strike, but it's a strike premium 160. Doesn't even have a grade. Um, again, I also picked this up uh, as a built guy. This is going. This is my first 160 uh, version. I've got the RGs, the MGs, the HGs. Unfortunately, this is not really a PG grade at all. Um, but yeah, so pretty cool. Anyway guys, I hope you like this video. I will likely plan to maybe paint this guy up uh, in maybe some custom colors. So let's see how it goes. Alright, thanks for watching and you have a good day guys.